Hey guys, what's up? It's Power of Aura, bringing you some more Black Ops 3 gameplay. Um, right now I'm currently working on Reaper and trying to get his costumes, obviously. Uh, I'm still just, I have already a few unlocked, but I'm just keeping the default one on. I'm really not looking forward to switching until maybe I unlock the white one. Um, I'm with my good friend Devontos, who I believe is work, has the Golden Reaper at the moment. That's what he's um, running with, I think. Let me see. He is running... Yeah, he has Reaper as well, but his he already got his in gold. Anyway, um, as far as the weapon, I'm actually using the KN44 this time. Haven't really used this weapon much, and I don't think I have any gameplays with it. If I do, they're pretty old. So, um, as far as the attachments I have on it right now, I have the Elo sight, and then um, grip and quick draw. That's about it. I was kind of thinking of, a, of extended mags, but I was like, ah, never mind. I'm the KN44 is already somewhat powerful. If you're wondering what the camo is that I have for it, it is actually called Gem. It kind of looks like dark matter in a way. Not exactly. There's you know more black on it, but um, KN44 is an okay gun to me. It, I really don't like it much. I kind of prefer the Man of War, but um, what I was going to say is the KN44 was actually known as the ARK7 in the Black Ops beta. Why did they rename it? I have absolutely no idea. Uh, but I actually pre... It sounds better as ARC-7. It, you know, to me, to me it makes the gun sound better. But KN-44 sounds a little cheesy. But anyway. Um, got some gameplay on the map Metro here. Um, actually did pretty good. You know, didn't go all out. Didn't come in first, but I did come in third. Um, Devonto... I think Devontos came in first. Um... What else can I say? Me and Devontos actually did a haha <laughs> nose break from behind. That's right. Anyway, um, me and Devontos actually did a dual commentary um, yesterday. I think he already posted it. So um, it was more like just talking about bad players in Call of Duty because honestly, that's something I run into. A, me and him run into that a lot. Like we will do good or, you know, we'll do okay. But it's like we have to kind of try because it's like I don't know why this has been happening to us since rolled out war um, that's when we started Call, um, Call of Duty he started first and then he got me into it and we've been playing Call of Duty ever since um, but ever since rolled out war I mean it's always me and him if we're lucky you know maybe we'll get a, a full party of friends but if not and it's just me and him playing yeah that was a freaking fail I tried to wall run and I messed up but anyway, like what I was saying, um, when me and, it's just me and him, and then four other random players, it never fails. For some reason, the Call of Duty servers always give us the bad teammates. And, you know, sometimes I'm talking to them, it's like, man, look at this, they give us a freaking Prestige 3, Prestige 4, even a Prestige 1. And they're playing so bad, and it's like... How can you be a, already in a prestige? You've played the game long enough to prestige, and you you should be kind of be playing decent by now. And you know, but anyway, that's pretty much what you're gonna hear in the dual commentary if you decide to watch it. And other than that, um, let's see what I think about Reaper. He's okay. Um, honestly, his voice pisses me off for a robot. I, I cannot stand his voice. I, I'm, I'm actually trying to finish up his challenges quick so I can stop doing him because his voice is just so annoying for a robot. But I do like his scythe. The only thing, um, obviously the scythe is super OP, but um, <clears throat> excuse me. what I don't like, and this happens to me a lot, every time I get the scythe, um, once I obviously transform and pull it out, or try not transform my trans the arm transforms and the gun comes out um i'll get like one kill and then die or either that the moment the arm transforms i die and it's like man yeah, this thing is so op that they purposely make you die so you can't even get any kills with it but i have gotten i think what a double a double kill before with it so i'm i'm actually looking forward to trying out psychosis i want to um try tricking players with that when I you know have to work on those challenges 
But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. And I will see you guys on the next one. Take care. Bye. Negative EKIA. Whiskey Tango Foxtrot. And strong. Positive optimal outcome achieved. Probability P of your favorable outcome FO approaches zero.